Lincoln. He is a year and a half old chocolate lab. Um, his owners say that he doesn't know a whole ton um, and that he's kind of causing chaos in their house. Um, basically, he is jumping on countertops, he's barking, he's wrestling a ton with his brother, who you guys are going to see. Um, and he is really, really rough for them to walk. Uh, so, hi bud, you're being real nice right now. Um, we are going to see a little bit of what he knows and we are going to see how he changes in the next 15 days. So, Lincoln, hey, can you come? Can you come? Can you come? You going to see that new York thing? Okay. Oh, you're going to go. Oh, that's awesome, bud. Lincoln, can you sit? Can you sit? Who is it? Oh, sit, good boy. Oh, that's a jump and that's a bite. All right. Lincoln, can you down? That's a sit. That's a good boy though. Can you down? Can you down? Down? No, that's a stand. All right, good boy. Let's see how his walking goes. Lincoln, come on, bud, you. he works with us in training and we're going to see how he changes in the next 15 days with his transformation. Check back in and see all of our other dogs on social media.
Jesse Castillo and my wife Mary. Uh, we own two precious dogs, one Windsor, uh, who is about uh, 21 months old now, born in January of 20, and Lincoln, who we acquired, uh, someone was rehoming him here in San Antonio, uh, the uh, chocolate uh, American lab full of energy. Uh, he is born on February the 11th, uh, and he is about 21 months old as well. Uh, we uh, have baby them at home, uh, read everything we could on the internet to try to find out how to handle uh, pups and uh, young young uh, adult dogs. Uh, and we had some difficulty. I'm the walker, so I take them to go walk. And at first it was kind of stressful when we used different type of collars and harnesses and uh, prong collars and anything we could read on the internet about uh, getting them to at least walk with us. Uh, and it was a struggle, but uh, I uh, put up with it every day because I love to have them. And at home, they're special and spoiled dogs. They have the run of a big room inside of our house, and they respect that. But they, uh, they're they very loving dogs, different personalities. Uh, but we, and we didn't want to trust their care to just anyone, so we were recommended bulletproof training, which we uh, checked out. And, uh, signed up and we went to Europe for 17 days and fretted about them every day that we were gone. Uh, everyone we looked at, we, we uh, thought about them and we appreciated the updates to see their their progress and we missed them every time we saw the pictures and my wife cried most of the time when she got them in the morning and shared them with me. Uh, but they're special boys and we came to uh, see them and see the training and the progress that they've made and we're absolutely ecstatic and we hope to uh, uh, keep the training up so that we can have two dogs that we can take and be proud of uh, that we love them to death. They're our, they're our world now. So, thank you guys from the bottom of my heart.